Hello and good evening. <laughs> Here again, 8 o'clock every Thursday, live from GJ's house. Actually, <laughs> this is not my house, but my conservatory. I try and put a different backdrop up every week to make it interesting. I've not gone for the... Uh, the green uh, green screen thing yet. I'm not sure whether I will because uh, I think in a lot of ways it can distract from the whole object of the idea which is to watch yours truly playing guitar and singing songs and talking rubbish. So, uh, so I don't know, maybe I'll give it a go. But uh, I keep buying different set of curtains for you every week. And jazzy new ties as well. I've got a jazzy tie on tonight. Right, I'm going to kick off then. Uh, this is, uh, you may, you may uh, recognise this song. It's uh, an old song from Ray Charles from back in the day. Great Ray Charles. Now, I'm just going to have a quick slurp. Wet the whistle. And uh, if there's, if there is anybody out there, it would be uh, great if you could just uh, 
let me know that everything's coming through okay uh, you are my uh, my sound engineer if you like just to make sure that the guitar isn't drowning the uh, the voice out and vice versa so if you can just put a comment on uh on the uh now let's see let's turn this thing down because that's better don't it ringing do it yeah so if you could comment tell me whether the balance is coming through that would be great uh i'll leave that going there for the minute this next song is a song I uh, I have an obscure taste. Uh, I like everything from jazz, blues, uh, Americana in general, uh, rockabilly, uh, country, country and western, hill country blues, that kind of thing. Uh, even down to Sinatra, you know, I love it all. But uh, I'm always finding uh, new new people on youtube i love youtube i love going on there and finding uh, new and exciting artists that without the internet we would never have discovered and uh, that's a thick the thing you know you just be an obscure musician just in a club in the middle of nowhere and no one would ever hear you but now with the internet everybody can hear you which is a great thing and there's one particular person called jp harris and JP Harris, if you check out JP Harris on uh, on YouTube, is he's absolutely brilliant. He's got a beard about this big; it's massive, and uh, it's a thing, isn't it, beards? In a row. <laughs> this one is all about uh, about travelling on the road and being uh, being a barfly, basically. This is called Badly Bent. And it's a honky tonky type of uh, song. My name is carved in every single bar from here to the Gulf of Mexico. And I've taken my time. To get to know all of the neon signs And I'm losing touch with the style of life that I know These clothes ain't dirty You know they're just stained By the honky-tonk lifestyle That I maintain This heart ain't broken Well it's just badly bent Every time I try to straighten it out, well, I wind up drunk again. Well, my usual prize winnings, well, they're always blue ribbons. And that's the kind best served cold and in a can. But I can win them just about anywhere with this old guitar and a barroom chair. The lodging's free if you know how to play your hand. These clothes ain't dirty. Well, they're just stained by the honky-tonk lifestyle that I maintain. This heart ain't broken. You know, it's just badly bent. Every time I try to straighten it out, I wind up drunk again. Well, I might cry every now and then. Well, my lip gets fat and my look gets thin. But even the highest of low lives must come down. But I get along mighty fine Living on chicken and cheap red wine There's always someone to buy me one last round These clothes ain't dirty You know that they're just stained By the honky-tonk lifestyle That I maintain This heart ain't broken you know that it's just badly bent Every time I try to straighten it out Well, I wind up drunk again 
Every time I try to straighten it out, I wind up drunk again. Every time I try to straighten it out, I wind up drunk again. Badly bent there, J.P. Harris. Check him out on YouTube. Uh, you'll find, if you like the kind of music I like, that uh, he's really good. That's better. Right, okay. Uh, who have we got in the house? Oh, Mike Cookson. How's it going? Mike Cookson of the Roadrunners. Terrific drummer. Cool guy. Not seeing you for a bit, pal. How are you doing? Right, okay, this this song is one of my own uh, songs, my own compositions, and it's uh, a song I wrote all about coffee, about Java, which is uh, one term for coffee is Java. And uh, basically, it's all about liking your coffee strong. Simple as that. Simple song. I'll pick it because uh, I'm going to pick it quite slowly because this is the first time it's come out and you're the first person to hear this. I don't want no sugar I don't want no cream That's the way I likes my caffeine I don't want it milky I just want it black Strong enough to give me a heart attack Wakes up every morning Just about a half past five Pour me up some Java Helps me come alive So don't make me no breakfast Don't make me no tea A big cup of Java is good enough for me some beans make them heavy roast the dark beans are the ones I like the most get that percolator bring it to the boil make sure that my coffee doesn't spoil I wakes up every morning just about a half past five Ball me up some java it helps me come alive And I don't want no sugar I don't want no cream That's the way I likes my caffeine I don't want it milky I don't want it black Strong enough to give me a heart attack Wakes up every morning Just about a half past five Boil me up some java It helps me come alive I don't want no sugar I don't want no cream That's the way I like my caffeine The song, Big Cup of Java. Right, okay. So, I'm 
I'm going to sing a song now which is uh, it's an old song I don't know exactly uh, how old this is but it's an old folk song and uh, it's all about when you get caught where you shouldn't be but you can't explain yourself because that makes things worse this is called The Long Black Veil Ten years ago on a cold dark night someone lost their life under the street lamp light there were few at the scene but they all did agree that the one that ran he looked a lot like me she walks those hills in a long black veil and she visits my grave when the cold winds they wave nobody knows and nobody sees yeah nobody knows like me Well, the judge, he said, son, what is your alibi? If you weren't at the scene, then you won't have to die. But I spoke not one word, though it would mean my life, cause I was in the arms of my best friend's wife. And she walks those hills in a long black veil and she visits my grave when the cold winds they wave and nobody knows and nobody sees yeah nobody knows like me Well, the scaffold, it was high, and eternity neared. And she stood in the crowd, and she shed not one tear. But sometimes at night, when the cold winds moan, in a long black veil, she cries over my bones. walks of those hills in a long black veil and she visits my grave when them cold winds they wave and nobody knows and nobody sees yeah nobody knows but me walks of those hills in a long black veil she cries over my bones when the cold winds they wave and nobody knows and nobody sees yeah nobody knows but me I said nobody knows but me, yeah, yeah. I said nobody knows but me, yeah, yeah. The Long Black Veil. Right, now, uh, let's put this contraption of torture on because this next song is a song I've not sung this for ages this is a this is a song 
uh, that I first heard by a fellow by the name of William Clark, uh, a harmonica player, long gone, as are most of the best ones. And uh, this one is an old song from about 1920 odd, but it was it, it's been uh, worked on, rearranged, as they say. And this is all about uh, it's all about a lollipop mama. And I used to sing this when I uh, when I had my band, Mr. G's Blues Band, and uh, we used to have great fun singing this because uh, because it's a, a fun song. Got a big fat mama, she called me her lollipop. Got a big fat mama, she called me her lollipop. Well now when she starts loving, she never knows when to stop. Well I love my baby, I love about night and day. Said I love my baby, I love about night and day. But I'm so scared my lollipop gonna wear away. Now what I've done there, put the bloody cap on the, <laughs> the wrong one, <laughs> which is why, as soon as I went to play, <laughs> as soon as I went to play, the key was wrong <laughs> on this, because I'm in B flat, and that should be an F. <laughs> this is live music, folks. This is the way it goes. So let's start again. That's bad, isn't it? Got a big fat mama, she called me her lollipop. Got a big fat mama, she called me her lollipop. Well, when she started loving, she never knows when to stop. Well, I love my baby, love her both night and day. Said I love my baby and love her both night and day. But I'm so scared my lollipop gonna melt away. itself she shakes like jelly and jelly don't shake itself well she shakes for me but she shakes for nobody else got a big fat mama she called me her lollipop I got a big fat mama she called me her lollipop well when she started loving she never knows when to stop well we're rock in the morning rock in the night time too yeah, we rock in the morning and we rock in the night time too. I don't want to complain cause she might rock you too. Got a big fat mama, she called me her lollipop. I got a big fat mama, she called me her lollipop. When we start loving, she never knows when to stop. She never knows when to stop. She's a real strong mama, steel on the railroad track. 
She's a big, strong bumblebee, steel on a railroad track. Got a hug like a bear, she almost broke my back. Got a big, fat mama, she called me her lollipop. Got a big, fat mama, she called me her lollipop. Well, when she started loving, she never knows when to stop. I said, slow down, baby, baby, you're hurting me. I said, slow down, baby, cause you're hurting me. But I feel so good from my head down to my feet. Got a big fat mama, she called me her lollipop. I got a big fat mama, she called me her lollipop. When she starts loving, she never knows when to... Probably, more than likely, politically incorrect in these times where you can't say anything, can you? You can't say anything that might be derogatory to anybody. I'm fat. I don't care. Well, I do, but can't do anything about it. My problem is chocolate. That's uh, that's the addiction I have is chocolate. I shouldn't do, but I do. Now, this last song I'm going to do before I sign off. Just at right on time now. So just before I sign off. Oh, before I sign off, thank you for the orders. Got some more orders coming through from you good people for my CD with a free DVD. So this CD, 10 tracks on it, all my own compositions, and also a free DVD to come with it, free of charge. All you have to do is message me on Facebook Messenger and uh, or you can go to www.gjarmstrong.co.uk and buy them direct off there uh, or you can just message me and I'll send you a link to pay with PayPal or a credit card and it's a 10 track CD it's 7 of your English pounds free posted directly to your door and as I say you got the CD you get the CD and you get the DVD. I'm doing everything on the screen. It's backwards. <laughs> right, okay. So, between 1906 and 1912, there was a young... This is a thing about, uh, about uh, rural America back in the day. A lot of people couldn't actually remember the date of birth because there was a lot of illiteracy back in the day there was a lot of people didn't read and write no one had a clock they got up when the sun come up and they went to bed when the sun went down most of the time and uh so you find this a lot that you know people's age is estimated but elizabeth cotton uh between 1906 and 1912 is uh is when she actually uh wrote this song and she wrote it when she was nine years of age now think about that a nine-year-old kid writing songs fantastic but there you go uh but this is uh this is a song all about a train you probably recognize it i've played it before
watch that old number nine come rolling on down the line. Freight train, freight train, it's coming so fast. Freight train, freight train, it's coming so fast. Please don't say what train I'm on, cause they'll know which way that I have gone. When I'm dead, Lord, and in my grave, no more good times will I crave. Just lay the stones at my head and my feet and tell the world that I've just gone to sleep. train I'm on, cause I'll know which way that I have gone. Freight train, freight train, it's running so fast. Freight train, freight train, running so fast. Please don't say what train that I'm on, cause they'll know which way that I have gone. So there you have it, Freight Train. Thanks for tuning in. And uh, don't forget, every Thursday at 8 o'clock, I'll be here. So be there or be square. Take it easy. Y'all be cool now.